Good morning everyone. I am Dr. Lakshmi Pallavi, Assistant Professor from the Department of Mathematics, BSH, BV Raju Institute of Technology, Narsapur. Today, I am going to explain about limits and continuity for in the course Fundamentals of Mathematics and the topic name is Limits and Continuity. So, first let us see what are limits and continuity. Okay, first let us see what is a limit okay see now i have a glass with me and i have a bottle of water now what i am doing is i am pouring water in this glass okay i am pouring water in this glass till where can i pour the water yeah till where can i pour the water till the end or till the point till here yeah i have not poured till here but i can pour water till here if i pour water more than this, what will happen? It will come out or water will spill. So, the point till where I am pouring the water, what is this called as? This is called as, you can call it as end point or uh, the uh, final value or something like that. So, what is this? This is called as limit. Yeah, what do we say this? We say this as limit. The point till where I am pouring the water is called as limit. Now, if we speak mathematically, yeah, if we speak mathematically, when I am speaking mathematically, if I take pouring of water into the glass as a function and the point till where I am pouring the water is the limit point, then the capacity of water this glass is holding is called the limit value. Yeah. Can, uh, do you want me to tell once again? See, listen carefully. If I take pouring of water into the this glass as a function, the point till where I am pouring the water is the limit point and the capacity of how much water this glass is holding, it is called as the limit value. Mathematically, when we take this, let f of x be a function, then limit exists or limit is taken, limit is taken at a point limit is taken at a point then limit x tends to a f of x equal to l is called as the limit value limit x tends to a f of x equal to l is called as limit value like suppose example if you take f of x equal to x cube then Limit x tends to 2 f of x will be limit x tends to 2, 2 cube that is 8. So, the limit value is how much? 8. Now, I take one more function f of x equal to 2x square plus x plus 1. Then, if you take the limit as 1, limit x tends to 1 f of x will be limit x tends to 1. 2x square plus x plus 1 or 2 into 1 square plus 1 plus 1. So, that is 4. So, what are we doing in finding the limit of a function? We are just looking into the function, taking the limit value and then what we are doing? We are just substituting it wherever you see x. Wherever you see x, there you are putting that value. If it is addition, we do addition. If it is subtraction, we do subtraction and then we get the result. That is called as limit of a function. I hope I am very clear to you. Thank you. Like, share and subscribe. Hit the bell icon for more updates.